friends, in this video we will see direct chop by my fellow. By this time the main incision has been made, capsular axis has been done, hydrodissection has been done and the anterior chamber has been filled up with visco. And now here goes the phaco needle. Phaco needle goes with its bevel down and now some superficial cortical lens matter is being removed by heart and now this is a, a real time surgery and let us see how carefully she does direct job. The handpiece has been rotated by heart and now the tip is buried in the substance of the nucleus a nice hold is achieved and then she uses the chopper to get a beautiful crack. And now she releases and comes to on heminucleus and divides this heminucleus in two pieces. And now she goes to the other heminucleus and by this time these small two pieces are in the anterior chamber and she is removing those two pieces. Now she holds the other heminucleus and another very good crack. And now emulsification of the pieces are being carried out by heart. See all the time the handpiece is very stable and the phaco needle, the tip of the phaco needle is in the center of the anterior chamber at the iris plane. And this is a real time video clip. And now um, this is a small hole in the epinucleus and now she is trying to pull the epinucleus and emulsify the epinuclear material. At this time the vacuum is low that is why the pieces are not coming. So I am thinking if I would instruct to use little higher vacuum to do this. Uh, here I instruct my assistant, uh, our assistants to increase the vacuum and see how easily the epinucleus comes to the tip. But she is very careful not to catch the posterior capsule and she is always at the central 3.5 millimeter safe zone and now she is trying to hold the small piece of nucleus at the side port and she has done it. So it is a very nice job by my fellow. Thank you very much for your attention.